the options are endless kind of with how many siblings we could have. So we could always yeah. be bringing in new people to um, have a new storyline, which is very cool. Excuse me, sir. My source alleges that you use your own sperm to impregnate a woman at the Beckley Clinic. One of my first questions that I, I asked the showrunner at the very beginning is how do we define this family? And what are, what is this relationship that we all have? Do we have an innate sense of um, familiarity to each other because you are siblings or is it completely new and you're, and you're strangers and I think that that's the interesting thing with our dynamics on the show is that we are getting into these little bickering matches or we're having things in common or seeing things the same way and that's because of us being genetically connected but at the same time we grew up completely different mm -hmm. so our viewpoints of the same things are, are different and so it really asks a lot of questions of like is it nature versus nurture and how do you define your family? Patients of the Beckley Clinic, the whole story of how they came to be could turn out to be a lie. Patients are taking matters into their own hands so they can find out the truth. Well, there's a couple different stories. There's a couple different doctors who are guilty of doing this. Actually, it's been in the news kind of a lot lately. The, a couple weeks ago, the New York Times, the cover okay. of the New York Times Magazine was all about this guy who did a photo essay and found his 32 other siblings based on on DNA testing. And it's very topical, it's very cool to have people reach out even before we've aired and say, I had a father that was a sperm donor and I didn't I didn't know, and it's kind of everywhere. And yeah. it's amazing to do a show that's sort of in the news in, in a lot of ways. And in a lot of people's lives too. There's you know probably someone you know or someone in your family has done IVF or something like this or has gone through troubles getting pregnant and, and redefined their family and it's a new type of family. So I think yeah. that that's why it's really topical and, and poignant because this is what people are going through right now. Well and the science is also moving really quickly so this is really just the tip of the iceberg I think in terms of like what we're gonna find out and the questions we're gonna ask ourselves as as a society, the ethical questions that we're gonna to have to answer and the responsibility we have to take for the new technology. And I think we'll, we'll address all that stuff on the show.